Ritter is with us right now. Look at this clean-cut, handsome young man here. I just want you to look at this face before we go to the clip. Yes. Okay, this is what he looks like. He shaved the... for us. I did. Yeah. So... All right, he stars uh, in the movie Hits, which made its debut at the Sundance Festival last year. It's a crazy. Love. We know what I love about it. It says, this is a true story that hasn't happened yet. Yes, exactly. Okay. It's an absurd look at fame in this age of YouTube and incessant narcissistic exhibitionism. Uh, this scene, uh, Jason's character agrees to help a young girl who is desperate to become a famous singer. Hi, I'm Caitlin. Hey. I'm... I I met you at Justin's graduation party at Liberty Lake that one time. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. Oh, Julie told you about recording, right? Yeah. Oh, like today, right? Yeah. Can I come in? Yeah, of course. Oh. Nice moment. That yeah. beard is so disgusting. It really is. You awful. just told me it wasn't a real beard. It wasn't a real beard, but you could really like tug on it. And yeah. you could were you going like this all day? It. Yeah, it was. It was so people were like recoiling from D me. Describe well. The beard is is, is certainly f suits the character. Yeah. Yes. He's Talk about that guy a little bit. Um, he's basically a dirtbag. Yeah, um, basically a dirtbag. He he's he's taking advantage of the fact that. Uh, he has a recording studio, and this this young girl has dreams, and um, a lot of people. He's seen a lot of people with dreams, and he knows how to manipulate take their money. those dreams. <laughs> yeah. take their them. money, take their morals, take their. We own. could exactly. only show a little bit yeah. of that. Yeah, clip it it just goes downhill from there. Yes, yes literally. <laughs> that was the yes, nicest exactly. part. Yeah. yeah. Taking her money was the second nicest part. Yeah. Yeah. And then there's the real stuff. And then yeah. there's the real For stuff. For which I want to slap you across the face. I, hey, I know. Okay. I was surprised when I got but the script from David Cross. This, I was like, this is the part? That this happens. happens. It, I mean, it does and, happen. And that's what's great about this film is it's mocking how obsessed people are to be famous. Oh, yeah. And, and in many ways anything. famous for being famous. Yeah. yeah, for for nothing. For nothing. You just you it's it's this this thing of needing attention to such a crazy degree that yeah, you'll people will do anything. And, and yeah. this isn't LA. This is a nice small town upstate New York, I think it is. Yeah, yeah. Liberty. Liberty in New York and she's a girl who desperately wants to be famous because everybody's famous and her father, a strange duck, inadvertently becomes famous. Yes. Which is which is part of this and you realize uh, something we talk about here all the time, but you realize something's changed. Oh, yeah. You know, um, your dad, your grandfather, was a man named Tex Ritter, a great country singing star and acting star. He was famous because he did important things. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. He had talent. Right. It was like, a, your dad was famous because he did important things. Now you're just. You have a sex tape yeah. and famous. you're famous. I know, it's true. Not you. Not me. Not, not me. you yeah, personally. Yeah. <laughs> not yet. Other not people. Not yet. I know. Yeah. I haven't gotten to that point yet. But, you know, uh, and, and no, this, but yeah, this is where David Cross is going with this yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's that that has become the, the final hope. Not, not a, the, the fame, not a byproduct of the job that you do right. or the art that you do or anything. They don't care about that stuff. People just want to be doing the interviews and getting they, the photographs They want to be on the red carpet. They, they don't, the product's stuff. not important. Just being on the red yeah. carpet, having Ryan Seacrest <laughs> interviewing you. They, that's exactly yeah. right. And yeah. I would think you have a completely different perspective growing up in a famous family. I would think you probably want the opposite. Like if you could act and never have the fame part, would you go for that? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. It's because the, it, 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 I, it can actually make it more complicated. You know, back in the old olden days, people could sort of reinvent themselves with every movie, and a lot of the the people who are still able to do that don't really do this. Because other there's still part. some mystery. I mean, yeah, there's, there's some, some mystery. You know, we mm -hmm. still want discovery now. These people come up wanting to be on TMZ, right? Exactly. As opposed to avoiding TMZ. Yeah, mm -hmm. we didn't know about Joan Crawford until Mommy Dearest came That's out, right. and now Mommy Dearest is every day. I, on TMZ. I don't know if I've asked you this or not, but was there any way that you wouldn't be an actor? Um, yeah, there there be some ways that I I wouldn't do it. Um, if if I if I could ne if I could never get a job, I would probably. <laughs> 
just have to figure, figure something, something else out. out. Yeah. Well, but then you'd just be an out of work actor. <laughs> That's true. That's true. I think I would probably You're resourceful. Be an actor, you'd you know. come up with something. I would come up with. Well, okay. I, I realize that you can be an actor in any kind of context. The the fame part is the stuff that you yeah. can't control, but mm -hmm. I could go do something in a park that I wrote Theater. and yeah. be sure. like, I'm an actor. You know. Yeah, no, and that's acting. That's yeah. the purity of acting. Look at yeah. me. You got, you I'm an actor. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> There's still movie, some attention. Another movie there. coming out. Uh, yes. Oh, that's right. Yeah. It's called. Uh, Sidekicks. Yeah, it's called. Shall Sidekicks. I tell you what it's called? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> Sidekicks. Okay, yeah. all right. Tell us about this one. Uh, this was a, Rob Benedict um, wrote and stars and uh, directed this movie called The Sidekick this about. This is hysterical. This, it's, sort, it's amazing. It's this world in which um, sidekicks and villains just walk around with regular people. It's a, mm -hmm. And it's a job that you have. Mm -hmm. And he's gotten too old and he gets fired by um, his boss. And he. So he's a sidekick without a hero kind of wandering oh, around. Oh, what do you do? And uh, mm -hmm. we, exactly, what do you do? And so I, I play his replacement, who uh, has a slightly shinier version of his ah. outfit. It was a big hit at Comic-Con, right? It was so much fun, and it's yeah. got such a great cast. With okay, when is that open? And Jordan Peele. Um, that is out now, I think. You can get so it online, can get it online this month. Yeah, this yeah. month. Online, yeah. And uh, Hits opens on Friday. Yeah. Great Good to stuff. see you. Thank you Thank so you much. much. Thank you. Okay.